filming? You ready? Are you filming? Are you, are you okay? Can we? Can you tell me what you're filming? I haven't changed much over the years, have I? Okay, this is Labor Bear. You guys already met Labor Bear. He looks a lot smaller now because I'm a lot bigger. Um, and then here's the infamous toe scar. Anyway, Labor Bear has been with me through multiple journeys and uh, moments in my life. Every time I go into surgery, I put one of those uh, hospital doctor caps on his head and then a little mask on him and I put him right here and then we go into surgery and as I'm going under when they're trying to hook up my thing, I squeeze the living shit out of him. Like, he's been squeezed. Like, I'm trying to make this all cute, but really, in actuality, he's been squeezed so, like, if he was a person, he would have looked like a pancake by now and have, like, blood and guts everywhere. That's how much I, like, one time, oh, one time I went in to get um, an IV put in and they couldn't, they had to, like, dig around. So I started off, like, holding his hand like this, you know, I was like, oh, oh, it hurts. And then as time went by, I started, like, gripping the whole thing. And the next thing I know, he was just like this for the entire time. And I open it up and his hand is, like, bent behind. So anyway, I have mutilated this teddy bear, but he stays with me um, and he's also used as a headrest on airplanes. Uh, he can also function as um, a play doll for when you're bored in the hospital and you have children to come and visit you. We do surgery on Labor Bear. Oh, he also has, uh, he's gained scars over the years. He has this one from when I cut him open and pretended to do surgery on him when I was younger. And there's another one where I stuck a needle in his butt. <laughs> um, anyway, he's gone through hell and back in a fast car. Sometimes I feel bad when I look at him. But I feel like if Chucky was real, like if Aunt, if dolls could come alive, he would probably want to perform surgery on me, or like get back at me somehow, and then it scares me. I actually put him under my bed for a whole month because I was terrified that Chucky was real and that he was gonna like come back for vengeance. And then I felt really bad because then I had hit him under the bed and I was like, oh my god, he knows that I don't, that I'm scared of him and now he's obviously going to come back and get me. <laughs> it's, everyone laughs, but it's true. Labor Bear is all I bring. He's all I have in this world, really. Like, you know, everything else fades if all, I'll lo if all love leaves me and everyone abandons me, I will have Labor Bear.